Hello everyone! In this video, we're going to take a phantom available on phantombuster.com called LinkedIn Message Sender and send follow-up messages to our existing contacts. The first step is to go to phantombuster.com and head on over to Phantoms and LinkedIn. Next, we want to find the LinkedIn Message Center phantom and click Use This Phantom. You should already have the Phantom Buster Chrome extension installed on your browser. All you need to do is click Connect to LinkedIn, then click Save. Now we want to choose the LinkedIn connections that we want to send a follow-up message to. You can use your previous phantoms or you can use a URL to a Google spreadsheet. I've already set up my spreadsheet with three connections that I've recently made that I want to send a follow-up message to. So now I need to make sure that this spreadsheet is publicly available. So I'll go, I'll go up to Share and click Change to Anyone with the link. Then I want to copy my link and click Done. This will allow Phantom Buster to access this spreadsheet. I'll go back to my Phantom and make sure that a URL is clicked then I want to right click and select paste to paste the URL of my spreadsheet. Here is where you want to write your follow-up message for your connection. I already have a follow-up message written which says great to connect with you first name. So I'm going to select all and click copy. And in the input section I'm going to right click and click paste. Keep in mind you can use any personalization variable in your connection message. In this case I'm using pound first name pound with the N of name capitalized which is also the column header in my spreadsheet. As long as the spreadsheet column header matches your personalization you can use it in your connection message. Then I'll click save. Here is where you can choose the number of profiles to send messages to per launch. Since I have less than 10, I'm going to leave it blank, which will send to the first three URLs. I can also choose Enable Profile Scraping, and I can set different conditions for sending messages. I can send to all, send only if the last message was from the recipient, or send only if the last message was from me. For this, I'm going to choose Send to All then click Save. Now here is where I can choose my email discovery service. For now I'm going to leave it as none and click Save. Depending on how many connections you want to send messages to, you can choose to use this repeatedly or manually. For now I'm going to leave manually. I can also choose to get notified in case of an error, then click Save. So now my LinkedIn message sender is ready to launch. All I need to do now is click launch. Depending on how many connections you're sending messages to, this may take some time. So that's it. My LinkedIn message center phantom has successfully sent follow-up messages to each of my contacts. Keep in mind there are rate limits for LinkedIn auto messaging. If you have a LinkedIn regular account, we recommend that you send no more than 80 messages per day. If you have a LinkedIn Premium or Sales Navigator account, you can send up to 150 messages per day. Be sure to go to phantombuster.com and create your account to start using this phantom. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel.